In part, there, there was a liquidity issue in the U.S., which was resolved by an expansion of the Federal Reserve balance sheet, but also programs such as the Troubled Asset Relief Program, or TARP. And, and both of those worked very well. And investors could feel very confident when, when the Fed, when Ben Bernanke and when Hank Paulson stepped in, Hank Paulson at the Treasury, Ben Bernanke at the Fed, when they stepped in. With Europe, I think it has a similar impact, but it is right now predominantly just the European Central Bank, the ECB. And two, there is a difficulty, and I don't believe that investors can have the same degree of confidence, because in the US, it is a single entity, the Fed, and a single entity, the Treasury, operating. In Europe, the European Monetary Union is one central bank but representing 17 different nations and it's much more much more difficult to have those policies put in place and more importantly more difficult for the marketplace to gain confidence i think it'll be a, a middle of the road type of performer as we go forward it, it does have some challenges it does have some challenges that are important for the government today and the marketplace will want to see progress on those challenges i don't think they'll see a lot in the short run and for that reason i would say india is likely to be a middle of the road performer among the emerging markets